All right, listen up. We have had a bit of a phenom that happened. Historically, summers are slow in the industry, but it's been on the contrary. We had a great June, and we had an even better July. I think we had the best July we've ever had, minus Marker's beard. You need to trim that down. You, you have a round face, and that too much hair makes you look like hairball. Come on, 24-7 it's, it's, that's, that's an everyday occurrence. Easy on the calculator. <laughs> Where'd you get that? <laughs> that's good. Easy on the calculator. Easy, easy on the calculator, easy. Bone to pick with you. Where are my short videos? You made one. 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 You made one. I have one more to upload, one second. You're supposed to upload one a day. And I know Matt's helping. It was free. I posted one. I'm working on You're it, supposed to post one a day. I know, but it's like my... my what's, go, what's going on with the big bulgari necklace? So we, put, we got in a great offer, and we're, we're seeing what's going what's to happen. I mean, she, she, she offered 20%. I think we could do it, but I think I want more. The other thing you need to know about is there's going to be some major changes coming within the sales department, the marketing department, and uh, some other departments in this company because Stuff has gotten a little bit out of hand in terms of process of it and, and stuff like that. And uh, quite frankly, I'm tired of yelling at Marco, so we're gonna have to change a few things. The whole cheese stick situation, break it down. What's going okay. on? So actually, Kevin should be in this conversation. Come here. Kevin, explain to me about this cheese steak guy. This guy's legit, bro. He's from my hood. Oh, that, 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 okay. He's from Parkwood. If, if he's from his hood. I'm there. friends with him. You like too. this shirt? I saw you looking at it. This is when Javante yeah. Davis knocked out Ryan yeah. with the rib shot. Tell me about the cheese steaks. I knew about him because of my brother in law. He's a firefighter and they live on the same like strip. But okay. like in Parkwood, he's known for this cheese steak. Like seriously, like it's good. You go on a waiting list, I think he makes like anywhere from 60 to 80, depending on the demand, and I haven't even been able to get on the list. Everybody says P Pat, Gino, Steve, this guy's like a sleeper in a small neighborhood, but everybody knows about him still. All right, well, what time is he coming? 1.30. I'm gonna be hungry before that. I'm gonna need a snack. So I was at a party over the weekend and I met a client that's a real estate investor and is looking to pivot into watch sales. You know, my family was, they were very opulent. They liked yeah. the nice things. They liked mm -hmm. nice things. And um, I would see my father having uh, luxury watches and mm -hmm. things like that. Never dawned on me to like, you know, we're, I'm young. I don't know what's yeah, going yeah. on with that. Turn it into a, to a business, right? I, it's been promising. Mm -hmm. I sold over three watches now. You buy them right, you know, they're, they're definite um, good uh, ways to, to kind of stock your capital, stock your, your wealth and, you know, tuck away with something you can wear for a little bit. And then if you buy it right down the line, you'll sell it and you'll be able to make a, a little bit of money. Absolutely. You know, this is actually one of my favorites here. This uh, It's a platinum perpetual. Go ahead and try it on. It's, it's nice. missing a couple links, so it might be a little bit small for you. But nice. those platinum links are real hard to you get. You know what? I, I, it's definitely small. My hands yeah, are yeah, rather yeah. big. Yeah, my hands are rather yeah, big. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, that's a, it's a really, really heavy piece. I mean, at the height of the market, this was like around like $500,000. Now we're now we're like we're like at four for this one here. This is another one right here. This is a really under the radar type of piece. This is the um, Cartier Rotonde. Rotonde means a uh, uh, round, right? It's like really Art Deco, right? It kind of has this kind of grid-like pattern. But what's special about this watch here is that you see there's only so the the triangle here is the um, minute hand, right? And there's no hour hand, right? We pull out the crown with this lovely cabochon that it has. So this watch is kind of participating with the uh, kind of the excitement and the anticipation of, you know, the hour that's to come, right? Say you give somebody an appointment at 12 on the dot, the watch wants to be part of it because at 12 on the dot, boom, you see how it switches to, f to, to five? Mm -hmm. So another time, that's what it's called a jumping hour. So all the gears in the back are holding tension, all right? Like I said, that anticipation until you hit 12 on the dot and then Boom, it switches to the next. These are the type of watches I like to sell and I like to show off because, you know, 50 grand retail, right? Very, very hard to execute uh, and this type of movement, but you're able to pick it up for like 20 grand, right? So, right. and when you buy it now, it's not yes. gonna depreciate a lot more than, than it had already, right? That's kind of like, it's depreciated to a level where it makes sense to buy, but it's only gonna go up from Absolutely, there. that's you know? Cartier. Yeah, Cartier. I really, really like Cartier. I started my career out in Cartier in Switzerland, so really? yeah, it has. I have like a deep connection with Cartier. You started in Switzerland? Yeah, yeah, I started in Switzerland. Yeah, I'm from Switzerland originally. Yeah. Wow, man, yeah, that's yeah. outstanding. I like, I like a good deal, right? For right. me, this is a good deal because right. there's a lot of intrinsic value. It's a gold watch. It has a special complication. You look at the decorations on the back here. Look at the case back. 
see all the attention to detail they did. Absolutely. And I just think there's some elegance. The French. Fr a French, yeah, French, but made in Switzerland, right? Right. But something about Cartier is just very elegant, right? Very refined and, you know, kind of under the radar. That Vacheron. So this is the 4500V, right? Prob this is the overseas, but the reference is the 4500V. I really like the black because it's subdued, but the blue is the most popular one because the blue, the way that Vacheron executes their blues is it's like a very inky, very deep blue. But what's special about this one here and what I like is, because I travel a lot, right? So I like to have watches that give you options. You get the stainless steel bracelet, you get a leather band, and you also get a rubber band. Or so rubber band for like when you're chilling by the pool, the leather band for the dinner or for the event, and uh, the steel bracelet for, you know, when you're traveling and you want something that's a little more more secure, right? What this is, is this? A offshore. Oh, this is an offshore. This is an offshore. We call this the Gulf, mm -hmm. uh, the petrol, the gas company. Mm -hmm. And uh, they have baby blue and orange features. Now, this is a new one. This is a 43 millimeter. That's oh, honestly wow. one of my favorite ones currently. Oh, wow. And, and I wouldn't mm -hmm. ever known for just from looking at this, being this up close on it, this is absolutely an exquisite watch here. Yeah, 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 it is, it is. Absolutely. Yeah. Appreciate, Appreciate it, man. it Thank man. you so much for coming absolutely, through, man. Absolutely, man. Hello, no, I haven't. What happened? Thank you, Natalie. Rough morning for Natalie. Too many requests all at once. Yeah. Dude, the condition on this with complete set, like I said, you know watches, it's yeah. pre-owned. Oh, Commitment from it. you this until is, I know. Exactly what I was looking for it's too. such a good piece. Uh, 2012 from what I saw, because we just sold two of these prior. We get them yeah. in, they go instantly. Every time we get a yacht master like this, I, I promise three days max, they go. Because they're in yeah. a good they're in a good price point. They're 11, 11, 5, 10, 5. Yeah, this one's 10, 5, yeah. complete set, got everything. It would be one of those things where the way I work and the experience I give, I wouldn't even want you to leave with it like that. I would order the links, get them in, put them on, mm -hmm. then yeah. Ship it out. Even if you want the pay, lock it down, oh, confirm yeah, it. That's cool. But I wouldn't. I would never want you to leave like that. So what we're checking now, guys, is um, obviously sometimes when we sell these watches, if it got sized up from an AD or a Rolex boutique or a previous owner, they'll just put the links in the box. So we'll actually eventually have to pull the box to see if those links are in there. If not, we're probably gonna have to get you a couple. I'll be right back. Okay. That could chill there. And then yeah, I'll be. Let me see. I'm gonna have to figure that out now. Um, can we see if that, that watch, there's no card on it? And can we see if the, if the extra links are in the box, possibly? No, no, they're on the watch. So it's just, we gotta have that order extras? All right. Wow, we dropped. You sure there's no extras on it? There's not even a card or something for that watch yet. No matter. I tried to browse. No, I just wanted to see. I that. guarantee it to you, we put all the links in the watch. I just wanted to see how many more we need. What's going on? If he wants it. No, no, we're good. We're good. We're good. Trust, trust me, you don't want a problem. Marco stopped me short. There's no additional links. Marco, Kevin, nice, nice to you. There's no additional links, okay. but we could obviously um, source them, get them for you, put them on the watch. Absolutely. Um, just because I wouldn't want you to miss what you want. That's not yeah, hard yeah. to come across a link like that. And then what did you want to show Marco too? Because I don't so, want you to. This is the tutor. Oh, uh, see, so it's on the last trade one. Trade up. Like the normal Black Bay 41s, usually we're taking them in trade like maybe 2,000. Uh, no, not even. Uh, but something like this two tone, like. I mean, the issue is there's not much gold weight on it. It'd be like around 2,500 if I had to estimate in trade, roughly speaking. Okay. It's just a, a hard mover of a watch, no doubt about it. Yeah. Figure so can I take there. a look at the speed mask you guys have for a 46? And yeah, then the I know exactly which one that is. I'm going to keep this. Two, I'm gonna like just keep two. this then. Okay. I have 2,000 in cash as well, and then maybe I can take a look at the Seamaster. I can pull whatever, one. yeah. Yeah, I got the, the pictures of what you had, so I can pull them. Yeah. I'm just trying to think of the of that, the what way. way you'd want to go about this so that you're comfortable, Kev, mm -hmm. so that you don't feel, would you want us to come across the links, get it all ready, and then you do payment that way? Because I could put this on hold, it's considered yours. No, it's awesome, man. I like yeah. people to come down there straight to the point in a good way. Like, I'm patient, but like, you know, I want to make sure the, when people are coming, they're having a good experience and they get exactly what they Absolutely. want. Absolutely. That's why when I when you told me you were coming, right when you said you were looking at that, I marked them on hold because, dude, yeah. I've had things sell under people as they're coming here. Really? Yeah, they're oh, coming, they're crazy. literally on their way to our office and somebody's like sold, like that's between crazy. the online, yeah, yeah, and then you got to tell them. And then they almost think like, there's no way, like prove it. Like, I'm like dude, it's sold. <laughs> yeah, like, it's sold. And then we got to fill the order. Guys, thank you so much. 
Absolutely. Really appreciate Thanks it. Well. Seriously, it's an honor to help you guys. So, great. all right, cool. Yo, Kevin, enjoy your new piece. Thank you for stopping by. This Pretty customer nice. just knocked on the door and said, "Hey, I want to buy some jewelry." I'm like, "All right, let's give me some, give me some ideas, give some options." And he decided that he wanted some rubies. This is the one. That, this is the necklace that you were looking at on the website. Please feel free to. I was gonna say, feel free to try it on. Yeah, <laughs> I wouldn't it. be the one wearing it, but. <laughs> Is the preference uh, on white gold or yellow, can, or can it be yellow? I'm happy you brought both out because I like to let them see both. Uh, and some of, the, and we do have like so some of the options with rings. We have some of the white here and then yellow to match on this end. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Like the yellow gold too a lot. I'm a fan. I, I think it pops too. I think it's, it does. Yeah. It does pop a lot. It's really nice. And I'll give you yeah price points on yeah, these things because sure. on on the upside it's different. <laughs> we could do pricing on these two. I really like. Okay. okay. So this one is two fifty five, and the the one that you chose was three sixty eight. Okay, that's not bad. That's perfect. Honestly, I'm gonna take these necklaces and we're gonna try them on. Yeah, that's, we could do I that. I think it's easier to that's, see. That's a good way to, to see on the on the neck. Well, I thought I would like that one more. Hey, but you know what? I your first, I'm, ha you, I'm happy you tried it on. Yeah, yeah. That's this, a, that's, that's this was your first. Uh, and that was your first choice to begin with. Right. So absolutely. I really like the gold, the yellow gold. I, yeah, I'm gonna I get like it. the yellow. Yeah, I think it's the right choice. Yeah. I'm gonna do that. Beautiful, great choice. Yeah, I appreciate Look at that. that. He came I, in here, walked into the door, and was like, I'm here to buy some jewelry. Yeah. After waiting two weeks, the watch is here. It's a watch we could not find, but thanks to Adrian, he makes it happen somehow, some way. I think it came from HK. I don't even know where this watch came from. I'm gonna be honest, I have no idea. Yo, Brick is here. Yo, where was it from? From uh, uh, Taiwan. Taiwan. Yeah. Listen, he makes it happen. I couldn't find it. Two weeks, sending calls daily, two weeks with vacations and things. This guy made it happen, so let's go see how it looks. Hi. <laughs> Look who it is. It's Natalie and little Peter. <laughs> little is it good to go? All right, it's good to go, he said, guys. Damn, no wonder he wanted me to bring this up. This is husky. Ugh. Ugh. This is crazy, bro. This is low key heavy, man. I ain't. He got the right one, man. Finally, the brick came in from Taiwan. Guess I gotta be careful how I say that. Comes off a little. <laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna show Adrian what this looks like. Let's, I hope it lives up to the expectations. All right, here it is. Usually when people say things are bricks, that's a negative connotation, especially when you're shooting a basketball. So they well, call this a brick because of the weight. I said I had to specify what this brick was because it's from Thailand and I don't want people thinking. Woo! Dude, oh, it's super clean. I was actually quite surprised at how difficult it was to find. No, no dealers had a nobody. It is it's insane. And it, the thing I liked about this guy, whoever he is, shout out to you, it only usually comes with this, this strap, right? The one that Adrian was saying, but he gave us these ones also, which I thought was super Little nice. Set on my wrist. Beautiful though. Strap options? Oh, hell yeah. I don't know how, yeah. I put that I on the baby blue. Yeah, the oh, baby, baby blue. blue. You wanna change up the vibe? I don't wanna wear the bracelet. You just throw the sport on, you know what I'm saying? It's like putting, putting a suit on versus uh Instant. Dude, totally different look. He just showed you two different ways to wear it in less than a minute. It's two, it's two different products. Burn it hot, man. In a matter of two minutes. Oh, so, dude, changes the whole look. You know what I'm saying? Much more comfortable. I love it. Right, yeah. I mean, what would you you're, listen? You're a tough grade, and he likes transparency. What would you say out of ten? It's definitely a nine. All day, yeah. I would say a nine. I mean, if Thanks, he wants man. it to hit, I'll hit there's, it. There's very, very minute signs of wear on it. Like you can you can tell that somebody wore this a few times, right. but it does not have deep wear. It was not worn a lot. Exactly. Bezel super clean. There's a few hairlines on here. Like I would give it, like I wouldn't say this is a, what they call a slider, so to speak. A slider is like new. I would say that it's that it's eight out of ten condition. Okay. That's fair. So if he wants a touch up, and I would tell him, I would tell him, listen, well, we can touch it up for you at any given point that you want. You can send it back to us. Right. But the bottom line is, is like the moment you put this on and wear it for a week or two, it's going to be back in the same condition. Exactly. So. All right. So I'll be honest. This watch was super hard to find. Even had Adrian looking for about a week, which never happens. But we were able to get it done and get it to our client the next day. I'm hearing all these things about this cheesesteak. I'm salivating at the mouth. This was hyped up to me like the best cheesesteak oh, in the world. On, Limited edition, on. wait list, a whole to do. I cannot wait. We got six. It's it's greatness, baby, greatness. Yo, what, do think, what do you think about these steaks? They're about to be a 10 out of 10. You already know Parkwood, baby. Marco, why are you the first one here? I'm bad. <laughs> these are self-explanatory. Nina, can you tell me which one is mine? Yes. <laughs> well, I know it's the veggie one. That's it. <laughs> yeah, you got the veggie. 
Oh. Hey, you know she was sending those oh, videos wait. as well. Okay. Oh. Yeah. I'm sending Cecilia, can fun. somebody bring ketchup, please? <laughs> no ketchup. No ketchup. No ketchup. Try it out. Try it out. Ketchup? Uh, it's a rule, right? It's a rule. Oh, it's a rule. Oh, it's a rule. Oh, it's a rule. Really? That's wet. Yeah, the taste of it. Yes. Yes. Uh, you got wet. Uh -huh. mm. <coughs> who, puts, who, who puts ketchup Ooh. on the cheese? Mm. Mm. Roman's loving it. You can mm. already tell. Mm. <laughs> oh, he's, he's got something to say to people. Hold on, hold on. He's got something to say. Mm. It's marinating. I'm f***ing speechless. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat this. I'm not gonna say shit. <laughs> Name's Pete Stampone, uh, from Northeast Philadelphia. Owner of Pete's Eats, operator. We started Pete's Eats in 2020, right when the pandemic. All the restaurants were closing down. So we started doing like family dinners right out of our house in uh, Parkwood, Philadelphia. Started to grow a little bit, you know, friends, telling friends. And then about a year in is when I started making the cheesesteak and that's when it's really started to blow up. I posted on Instagram, it sells out in like a minute, under a minute, so. You know, I've done athletes in the city, uh, comedians, um, even like adult film stars, like anything you think of. So it's just started to... <laughs> um, yeah, so we've been open almost four years. Check us out, Pete's Eats 215, Pete's underscore Eats 215 Instagram. The cheesesteak was definitely a nine out of 10 minimal. Go check out Pete's Eats. Forget about Geno's and Pat's. That's horrible cheesesteaks. Adrian, Yo. do you know if we Paid for this watch yet? For sure not, since you're inspecting it. And the Santos? What's good? This is an Omega. I mean, I took one look at it. It's 100% fake. So now that I'm actually playing around with it more, look at the dial, look at the marker at 12 o'clock. Like you see how slanted it is? It's coming off the oh actual movement. Quantum of Folus. <laughs> <laughs> Just look at the movement, though. Quantum of Stolus. <laughs> Great A Canal Street. Yeah. Alibaba special. Look at that. To contact this gentleman yeah. and respectfully decline the watch. Send it back. That's what why we do quality control. Shout out to your boy Peter right there. That's it. The Don't try and send it in. It's going to get caught. Here's what we got. <laughs> we, 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 got a trio. we got a savant when it comes to the inner workings of a watch and what they do and how to buy. Savant when it comes to the tool bench and a savant when it comes to sales right there. Nope. We got we got a oh, three-headed monster. <laughs> what? They the sales. Three -headed goat. Buyer? Sales? Buying is more and sales. Hold on with that. Right. If you're a good buyer, Funny you're a good seller. One five hundred dollar sale you. that propelled this month. <laughs> <laughs> Who's year to date hire? Woo! Me. That's tough. Ooh. Who's somebody's who's life, who's lifetime hire? Somebody, okay, you've been here three years versus one. I can check. Check, check my check every year. Right check every year. <laughs> year to date. Men lie, women lie, numbers don't, right? What's going on? 18,000? What's going on here? <laughs> Talking money. Nah, I'm missing like 500,000 money <laughs> from, that, from, from Zendo. <laughs> Give me the music. <laughs> Give me the music. Same thing, too, but. Ooh! Smoke show. Smoke show. Marco How bad? That's crazy. How, Man's did that on camera. That was he's foul. Up. He's up. 7.7. 7. What's he got? You know, I remember this Instagram story, right? Where it was. I, I'm calling a comeback. Big motivator. Are you ready for this? Marco's big, big, big motivator, okay? Yo, this is head to head between the two. Are you ready? December, yeah, Roman said, right, if you average a million a month for Alex six for months, I'll give you a free watch. Yeah, pull my ear to date. a million a month. You guys need for seven months. You want me to bring the gloves in? I got the gloves at home. You guys could just... That one's good. My, my margins I would say you're... You. Huh? My margins will cook you at half your sales. Whoa. Okay, who's brought in more money? I'm a buyer and a seller. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, that's all, that's all. Done deal. All right. Listen, it's all love with Alex. There's just a little internal competition, but I'm just blowing him out of the water. <laughs> <laughs> Do I want to pull up Google reviews? Y'all talk hold about it. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> When it comes to Kevin's progression, I'm so proud to see how far he's come, not only in sales, but also just in the way that he services his clients. It's really a pleasure to see his development, and overall, he's killing it. Dave, Dave would be what? Most well-spoken. He's yeah. like, he's the... The most cultured, by far. Most this guy, cultured, dude, yeah. this you guy, know, you could, man will just walk dude, you can precision. Can any, he is precise. Any environment. Anything from his David Chino's, yeah, you know, Dave is the most he cultured. He, he's you the most, he, he's the most <laughs> precise. And I would say Anna is the most just, like, doesn't move <laughs> from her desk. <laughs> She's the most focused. She's like a silent killer. She sits sure. there focused. And I am apparently the psycho. Listen, he's averaging so a million a month. So around... 1.1 a month. No, he's not, is he? Yes, he That's is. That's amazing. Yo, Roman owes you that watch. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, 
Yeah, don't put him on ice like that. He won't That's like that. Yeah, no, no, I, like no, I'll put him on ice. You will about of that? Of course. What? A man needs to pay his debts. This is why Adrian talking is to nobody Adrian in specific out there. If, if but, Adrian um, <laughs> puts him on ice for that, Adrian's different. That's crazy. I would never. I know, bro. Do you really think I have an issue putting Roman on ice? I mean, bro, you not see daily. Bro, that's okay, a if, big I, if, I send, if I send huh? this to you bro, right now, you Roman, post if it. you do not pay your debts, and what was the bet? Send it to. He him. said. When you average a million a month for average six a million months, a month for I'll six months, I'll get you a free watch. Oh Whether it's an Oris or a Tissot no or a Nomos. <laughs> Hold on, there was a picture of a watch. Oh, here he goes. This is who you should be. This is who you should this fear. You, should you know. You know what's crazy, right? Every morning he comes up to me and he looks at me and says, "Marco," and just looks at me like that. He, he has to say nothing. Else, what right? did you sell? Pa, what did you? Even, I don't even ask. Yeah, you don't. I, look, I just look at you, yeah. Marco. <laughs> what did you sell today? I asked him that this morning. I just sold a three carat stone. Ah, shit. Yeah, what did you sell today? <laughs> this looks like it would fit my wrist. Just five minutes, bro. Here you can have it. All right, thanks. Come up, <laughs> come up off that. <laughs> right. One more clip, you're going to be out that window, I know, son. I know, it's only a one click allowed. <laughs> Easy on the watch. Easy on Easy the watch. Easy on the calculator. <laughs> Easy. Pa, should we make you a TikTok? For yeah, sure, it'll right, go right. viral instantly. We should, go, we should make we'll it go viral the first day. He's everybody's favorite character. Listen, I'm everybody's favorite person, okay? Yeah. You're my favorite person. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys think? Should we get Gary a TikTok? Yes. All right, guys, comment below if you think we should get Gary a TikTok. I think we should. Bob, we just caught a fake watch. What do you mean? What do I mean? Fake. Somebody sent it to you? Yeah. Who? C customer? <laughs> Who said it? Faker? Fake, fake. Which watch? It was a mega for 2,000 bucks, fake. And you bought it? No, we didn't buy it. We inspected it, decided it was fake, with that one. Yeah, but you can see it's fake. Well, that's why, that's why Peter gets <laughs> them, inspects them, and then brings them yeah, up. Yeah, you can see it's fake the way it's made. Yeah, yeah. Well, let me ask you something, Gary. Yes, sir. What's more fake, that watch or Kylie Jenner? I don't know. Kylie Jenner's a good kind of thing. No? She's claiming she's I mean, not. She's I mean, she's... Thing. What? She's saying now she's not. Bro, she's what? She's got the biggest lips I've ever seen. No, she said she's had under 10% procedures. That's, yeah. That's it's impossible. recent content. She's maybe, she's not. maybe she's like 90% procedures, impossible. 10% natural. I, yeah, that I think that's what she meant. That watch she is clearly figured in her. There's Who would you want to pay $2,000 for? Kylie Jenner or this one? I'm not... He ain't give me in trouble. Good try. Marco has a million for six months. Roman's going to give him that watch. Yo. Yeah, the fact that you really did that is scary because you could bring that up, but that, that's, out, that's out of pocket. Nah, no, I would never. They're on, a, they're, they're on a tear. These two are like neck and neck for the year. They're fighting? Who? Look, look wow. at his face. Look at his face. Neck and neck. Looking at the numbers, neck it looks like neck. a blowout to at me. Least. <laughs> it looks like a blowout to at me. Least. He's, he's too much behind. Okay, uh, listen, listen. I'm, I'm I, can, catch up. I, can, I can tell you, I can tell you, I can tell you one thing. I can tell we you. We were on a team now. Good. At least Alex is not bragging about it. Oh, oh, humble. So, so someone recognizes Alex, that. I don't Alex. speak about my, my any success. Yeah, and I haven't said a word about my numbers all year. I could really, <laughs> I could really be boasted. Dude, if he's, I he's right there. He's Kevin crushing. is right nah, there, he's man. He's crushing. No doubt about it. He's crushing. Yes, he, he, he's, he, he's not talking shit. No, I'm saying straight up. You're crushing, bro. Yeah. You're doing very well. <laughs> <Not fair. laughs> Comment below. He's healthy and well. Comment below your favorite character on Grey Market. It's gonna be Adrian, number one. Me, number two. Mar Margo's definitely gonna win. You know who it's not gonna be? <laughs> Roman. The <laughs> 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 alien. Why are you making fun of Roman? I love him to death. They have like a brother. I love, they have a brother I love Roman so kid. much, it hurts. Yeah, they have brother. But goddamn it. He's a piece unique. One on one. In fact, Michael Sharp has never have, has never been on the show before. Roman's dad. He's never been on. Nah, he's the character of all characters. Why won't he get on there? Huh? I almost had a heart attack today. Why? I'm holding in my safe. I'm holding a pair of earrings, uh, graph earrings with pink diamonds. They're sitting in my safe with uh, with all the paperwork, with the certificate in the box. I just opened up to look at them. They're not there. While I was away, you know, uh, Alex gave it to Nicole to take pictures and uh, never told me about it. I'm opening the box. There's no earrings in it. I almost had a heart attack. Can I ask you an honest question? Side. What did that have to do with Michael Sharp? <laughs> <laughs> This is what we go. This is what we go. This is what we go through as a family. Excuse me. 
We're talking about something. We're talking about chocolates. And all of a sudden, he starts talking about lawnmowers. And there's no segue into the conversation whatsoever. I thought, he, I thought there was I a thought there were Michael like Scharf. little Uzi stole them. No, I, I thought he was like, I took, I took the earrings out. I turned around, and Michael Scharf took them and went downstairs <laughs> and started, like, doing something with them, you know? Listen, I was thrown out of high school because of my ADD, okay? Uh, okay? It was, fact. Because of my ADD. Honestly, Gary, I love you. I can't wait to see you doing all these TikTok challenges. Guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and let us know what you thought about this episode.